In this video, I'll show you how you can use a ULN2803 to drive a motor. So, here's your input control. It goes through a switch and then branches off to pins 1 and 2. This is a schematic of the ULN2803 being used to drive a motor. On the input side there is a switch that is connected to plus 5 volts DC. The other side of this switch is connected to pins 1 and 2, which are inputs that control pins 18 and 17. One side of the motor is connected to pins 18 and 17. Hey guys, been trying to control one of these, or a few of these, with a few of these, what I've come up with is this. Next week I'm going to get another one of these chips so I can set the thing up. Let's hope it's not an epic fail and the whole thing blows up.